Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Icarus. I am Zystars, and there's been a new update. Every week, we, every week about, every seven days, sometimes plus, sometimes minus, but we always get constant updates with this game, which is one of the amazing things about it. What is the update today? Well, apparently there's something called a thumper. It's in, gotta be in the tech tree, tier four. I think I bought almost everything. Yeah, here we go. Prototype Thumper. Let's see. Deploy and activate to unearth mineral mineable ores. Replenishes mineable ores in the surrounding area. That's amazing. Like, really amazing. I'm pretty sure I have the power for this. But the only way to know for sure is to pop open, say it with me, eh, the spreadsheet. All right, I've got, yeah, I've got 1750 uh, uh, remaining right now. So we are good to go with the, with the power. All right, and we're going to put it, we're going to put it right outside because there's quite a bit of ores in the area. I want to see what it does. Uh, let's see. So fabricator, do we have any? Okay, we've only got two composites left. So let's refresh my brain on composite crafting. Um, oh, right. Iron, silica, gold ore. We should have all of that. Iron, gold, and silica. Was it a one for one? It was. Okay. Um, I don't know if I want... Yeah, let's just do 50. Why did it stop at 50? Oh, because it's two iron ore per. Okay, easy day. So let's let's do that. And then... Whoops, that doesn't go in there. We are getting kind of low on the gold. I did... On the empty ores. I did... What the hell was that? Huh. That was a weird noise. Uh, let's see. Let's at reactivate you. So I did rebuild this. I don't remember if I mentioned that last video, but I did rebuild the uh, thingamadoo here in order to get the 15% crafting or smelting speed. So that's pretty cool. And we've got a little... Oh, you know what? Let's pull, let's pull some of that gold unless we need more of those. I think... I think... Let's sort that stuff. I don't know why that stuff's in there. Okay, so we need... How much did it say? Let's see. Thumper. 12. Oh, and 8 concrete mix, which I think we have. Do we have 6 electronics? Oh, heck yeah. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Whoops, that was 5. 6. And let's get... Oh, wow, it's up to 20 already. Those craft quick. All right, let's get these in here. Drop those on. Get those out of there so they're not in the way anymore because that's a thing that happens all right that should be everything that i need and yeah let's craft this baby one nice benefit of the open world 90 kilograms jeez does it does it have to go here there we go <laughs> 90 kilograms now if I remember reading right, this thing is going to have... It's going to draw in bugaboos. So let's start with these. We'll see how many... Let's grab the hedgehogs. Because I think we're going to need to protect it. What time is it? Okay, we can get it set up. Uh, there's not much in the way of ore up there. But if we come down here... And... Oh, you know what? If I put it here, it's already going to be protected. And it sh that should allow it to... Yeah. I mean... No, uh, maybe I shouldn't. Because I don't, I don't want to risk the, the extractor. It's expensive. Let's just go downstairs. Whoop. I keep meaning to expand this deck out so that doesn't happen as much. And I need to put railing on this. Okay, are there bugaboos out here? I don't see any. But there's this cave right here. And if we could refresh the cave. Now, this thing doesn't refresh 
Is that the range? Oh. Interesting. Well, there's another cave over there. We want to move it? We could put it, like, in the middle of these caves. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Is there something here that we missed? What is that? How long has that been there? Oh, yeah, it's a silica ore. Neat. Now, the only problem is some of these ones, like this one, that are in the ground, if I didn't get all of it, I bet you it won't... Um, it won't refresh them, I bet you. All right, so, oh, you know what? A flat area is going to be better. Come down here. Because we're going to be able to get the barricades up with a flat area way better. All right, so let's drop you down. And then let's grab these. And wait, where's the, is that the on? Yeah, sequence active. Okay. Let's put a house around it. Too far. Okay, now the only other thing is, do we have room for these? Yeah, okay. I don't have a door, but that's alright. Colliding. What are we colliding with? Are we colliding with that? Maybe. We might be colliding with that. I wonder what kind of threats this thing's going to bring in. Okay, and then... Do that, and then... We'll do this. And then... Let's see what the spikes look like. Okay. We gotta make sure we've got them up high enough that I can repair the silly things. <laughs> there we are. All right, and now uh, one here, one here, one here, and then did I bring ladders? Yeah, oh, I brought all of the ladders. Let's put the ladders here. Okay. Now what's left? Hedgehogs. Do we want to put a hedgehog down? Oh, these are tiny. Have I ever used these? Why are they so small? Alright. And then we're gonna need... The hedgehogs probably are, are a dumb thing to put down. I should probably just put in more walls. Honestly. Oh, bugger. Heat wave. Yeah, because these hedgehogs, that's just like four things to repair instead of one. You know what I could do? I could just throw these outside of down below the stairs and just be good with that. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to put this here, like that. No. What was that? Oh, it's a scorpion. See, I don't, what I don't like is that this isn't centered. I would like that to be centered. There we go. That ought to keep the critters off of us while we're doing while we're doing our business. All right, where's the power? Let's run some power to this thing. It should need to be turned on, so it shouldn't automatically power itself. Uh, that's water. All right. Benefit to run in power all this way. We should have enough. You know what I need to do. I need to check my power, my wind water mills. I had somebody ask why I'm not going solar. Quite simply, I'm not going solar just because I don't want power to just run out arbitrarily. Now, I do know that solar would allow me to not need to worry about clearing out stuff. But I prefer to always have power on as opposed to the inconvenience of not needing to um, clear everything out. It doesn't look powered. 
Mineral nodes to regenerate 818 risk level high. But did it... Oh, wait, what? Hold on. Okay, that now it's now it's hooked up. All right. Prototype thumper. Okay, well we're not gonna do this right now because we have a we have a heat wave coming and I don't need to I don't need to get cooked. Plus I need to grab Healy Dews. I need to grab all my stuff and things, get the food in me and all of that. And hell yeah, baby, we're gonna give this a shot. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, if you watched my stream on Friday, you know that my OBS recording software got a little wonky weird and screwed up my recording. Yeah, I, you saw it at the end of the little bit where we were setting that thing up. So we're gonna have to redo all of that. So to kind of catch you guys up... Oh, how's my stuff? It's fine. So to kind of catch you guys up, we, uh... After, after dealing with the thumper, we put in a bunch of this stuff over here. I built this out and I saw... Thanks for the comments for all of the angled, the angled stuff. I ended up doing just one of these to finish getting this across, and then we kind of went up and around with the stone to just kind of see what we could do. And then we ended up with this stuff up here. So I'm thinking instead of all of this twisty twisty, I might just go straight down, but maybe not. I'm not I'm not 100% yet. I do need to throw in a whole bunch of rails because otherwise things are just going to go sideways. Um uh, it's getting kind of late. Let's go ahead and finish. I did make a little bit here. We'll do the thumper in the morning because I do I do really want to show you guys that because I, I think it's really cool. All right, let's go ahead and grab this stuff. Um, I'm not sure how much of it we're going to actually replace and how much we're going to actually use. Let's see, we just got through a heat wave. Love those heat waves. Now, one, two, yeah, we got plenty. I do kind of like this up here. I kind of like the little twisty, but I don't like the way that looks. Like, that's not super cool. Hmm. If we came out, how far would we go? Uh-huh, uh-huh. One. Um, there we go. Nope. Maybe not. What's going on here? There we are. And, okay, so it would take two to get up there. So it would come out to about here, and then there would be all of this space over here that's wasted. So I think we'll I think we'll keep it. Just to kind of keep things interesting. It does mean that I'm gonna have to go slow when I do come over here, but that's alright. And you're already cement. And I just need to replace this stuff. Okay. And then I grabbed enough of these to kind of ring around this, I think. Do we want that one? No. There we go. Oh, well, I guess we, I got enough to do all of them. Just about all of them. Um, let's go ahead and do... Pick these back up. And we'll do stone inside there. It's going to be hidden anyway with interior wood blocks. And then... I think I want these walls, the walls around this, to be made of glass. I think... I think. I think that would look pretty cool. And then we'll do interior wood. I like that. And then let's do this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I do love the cement. Three left. Is that a foundation? Wait. No, these are ceiling tiles. And... How does this look? Yeah, that does look a little little crude, doesn't it? With the gap there. Oh well. Oh, I could I could do I could do a pillar. I was thinking of running pillars anyway, though we are going to end up doing some railings the whole way across, I think. I think we I think we have to. Let's see. 1 2 3 4 5 probably 6 7 8 9 10 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, oh, 17, 18. We're probably going to need like 20 pillar or 20, 20 of those, which is a lot. And then we're going to need the glass walls and some sort of ceiling, which I'm not 100% yet what we're going to do for a ceiling. 
And then we're going to need two... Um, nope. Did I make... Oh, I do have some. We're going to need two of these. And we're going to need interior wood floors, but not until we get the wood... The wood up. Or, not the wood, this, this, the uh, roof and stuff up. Oh, you know what? We can't do a glass ceiling because of the those storms. Although, you know what? One of you lovely individuals suggested that lightning rods were protecting his base. Which is interesting. I never thought of that. So maybe we'll throw a couple lightning rods for testing purposes and just do a glass roof. Because if that's the case, that's that's pretty sweet. Oh, we need... This is going to be a cement right there. Yeah, baby. All right. And then this up here, we're going to need a cement one for that. But I don't have another one. That'll that'll pucker you. Yeah. All right. Let's get this crap put away. And yeah, I don't know what's going on with the OBS software. I do apologize for it getting kind of squirrely. Um, I have updated everything. I've updated my computer. I've updated my graphics adapter. I've updated the OBS software. Hopefully, the problem is gone, and we don't need to we don't need to worry about it anymore. But I don't know for sure. All right, let's go to the morning and get the get this battle going, or not battle, but get the thumper going. All right, now normally there would have been oh let's clear out the riffraff. There would have been a ton of there's going... Last time I did this, there was a whole bunch of... A whole bunch of... What do you call them? Nodes that needed dealt with or needed respawned. And as you can see with the, the oxide over there, that's not the case right now. There were 118 nodes that needed... That needed respawned before, which caused the threat to be high. Now, I'm curious because I have only taken out the... What do you call it? Um... I ran around and grabbed the uh, silica ore and pretty much nothing else. I grabbed a little bit of other stuff, but not not a lot. So I'm kind of curious how it's going to what it's going to be switched to. Oh, there's another one. If it's going to be a low or medium or something. So this will be good. So the first time we had a bunch of God, what are they called land sharks a bunch of crazy worm guys so let's see what happens and I, I i can't i can't feign my surprise like i did before but um it is what it is i guess maybe i'll throw that up on youtube for a member video you know uh, and maybe i'll just link it i'll link it for the patreon members as well because you, you guys it's it's not good but you can you can like you can watch it and listen to it for my actual surprise and because I had no idea what was coming. Uh, I don't want that scorpion or that dog. Uh, that's not what I meant to shoot. There's a cat, man. This place is crawling. Come on, cat. I remember back in the day when if you shot an animal near an elephant, the elephant would would rush you. Man, that was rough. Oh, oh no, I've got antibiotics. I need to redo my pills. Actually, someone mentioned that the chemistry station um, makes the pills. So I think I need to, I need to get building a chemistry station. I'm gonna need some more power for that though. Oh no, I need my, my, my uh, electricity tool because I disconnected the power from that thing because it is 1500 power. I disconnected my, my electricity tool. And I do apologize if the recording... Yeah, see, the recording software is getting delayed right now. All right, there's another scorpion. Hey. Hey, guy. That's mine. Get the hell out of here. All right, what do we got? Holy crap. Oh, he was eaten. Wow. Okay, so if you want... Oh, just a ton of critters to show up. I guess all you have to do on this map is put up one of these walls. Look at that. We got... that. That's a lot of critters. They're just throwing themselves on the walls. 
You know what might be an interesting way of doing it? Doing a U shape and just killing something and throwing it inside. That might be an interesting way to go about it. All right. Um, let's drop this scorpion crap out of my inventory. And okay, the mow is going the other way. So let's grab the electricity tool. There it goes. All right. Oh, I didn't check to see. What did it say? Okay, this is a low risk level because there's only 28 nodes. And it, oh, yep, it spawned one of the medium sized ones. Oh, there's the big one. Come on, baby, give it to me. Jesus. I didn't expect him to do that. Look at that thing. You giant. Here, let's go ahead and eat this. So their spit, you, you have to counter their spit with antibiotics. The big ones. They have a they have a different spit than the regular sandworms, because those are land sharks, according to the patch notes. <laughs> Alright, come on, baby. What a I wonder if it's faster. Um, oh yeah, it's already at 40%. Yeah, it is way faster if there's less nodes. So th this time there shouldn't be more than maybe two of the big ones. Last time I think I fought four or five of them. But yeah, I think I'll do that. I'll put the, I'll put this episode up uh, members for members only for Patreon and YouTube members. I'll get that up and you can, if, if anybody wants to watch it. And then I'll just put a link on the Patreon page if you want to uh, see my my initial reaction. I think I think that sounds fair. Oh no, this is a little one. Or no, that's a big one. Look at that! Here it comes. Oh, oh no, that's one of the medium-sized ones, isn't it? Yeah, there's no fins on this guy. Oh, that's regular poison though, instead of the antibiotic poison. This isn't a rifle. Come on, baby. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Jesus. There's two of them. There's... Yeah, there's a lot of these guys. Oh, their poison must be related to the antibiotics. Because I'm not... Oh, no, okay, I'm getting poisoned now. Maybe I was just avoiding it before. Yeah, I must have just been avoiding it before. Well, that's cool. So that was more of the medium ones than the last battle. Oh, we got another one. That This is probably the last wave. Uh, why isn't it... What is... What the hell is wrong with my... My bow? There it goes. Okay. That was weird. It wasn't it wasn't shooting. All right, the sounds are gone. That means this thing is done. So we're at Yep, it's back to low. So let's go ahead and remove the power. Fill that left. Oh, it's supposed to clean up the worm guys, make sure so there weren't any more spawning, but I guess it didn't do that. All right, so now if we run around, oh, that reminds me. Oh, the yeah, no, the okay. So it's got a circle. This is the area of effect. So it missed this cave over here, but it got this cave barely, and then the cave by the base. So yeah, see, we've got silica ore over here now. No, we don't. Oh, uh, maybe there wasn't. Oh no. Oh, this was silica. So it it's random. Oh, that's not good. That means I'm I'm losing out on silica ore by doing it without fully expend expending everything, because this was a silica ore before, and. Some of these were as well, but now they're all oxite. Okay, that's good to know. So it randomly respawns. Okay, so definitely clear everything out so you don't miss out on anything. But then if we come in here, this is all respawned. Look at that. All respawned. So we can come in and clear all of that stuff out and get more platinum and all sorts of good stuff. Hell yeah, baby. 
That is so cool. It's so cool. It's such a neat device. But yeah, definitely clear everything out before using it again instead of the partial. Because I got a lot of silica ore out of that. I think it had... It, it had like, you know, maybe two full rows, maybe three. So it was pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Boy, you gotta love those storms, huh? <laughs> Alright, so we are putting together... Let's see. Uh, let's go see what we're at. Putting together the walls for that side building. We're at five... Max? No, nope, not quite there yet. And oh, and we're going to need roof pieces. I think we're going to go sh just straight into the wall. So we need probably probably nine. Probably nine cement. Which means we're going to need some more rebar. Let's grab that. Nine cement slopes. I think. I think. What do we got here? Twelve? I don't think I need twelve. I, I'm pretty sure it's three wide, right? So we'll do nine. All right, so I think we're done here. Yes, beautiful. Beautiful. Now we just need where to go. We just need the, uh, the glass to get, or not the, yeah, the glass to get done. What are we at, six? Oh, man, that's going to be so much, though. I wonder if we should do a second one of these. Uh, we're close. Let's see. That's seven. Two more and we'll have it. Oh, baby. Yeah, baby. We're going to get this done. We need the epoxy. Oh, man. We are going through epoxy. Let's see how this thing came out. Because there's so much oxide, I went ahead and made just a crap ton of resin so we don't have to worry about it. We weren't, aren't going to have to worry about resin for a long time. Oh, you know what I need to make? That, well, not need. Need's the wrong word. But it is really cool looking. Um... It's called an Oxide Dissolver, I think. Is it Ox? I have it unlocked, don't I? Tier 4. Is there an... There's an Oxide Dissolver in here. It's a. It's like a big... A big one of those Ox... The little, the little one that I have. It, it's pretty cool looking. Oh, you know what? I bet you... it. No, you make it in here. Yeah, here we go. Oxide Dissolver. It runs off of biofuel instead of sulfur. And we're pretty close to it. We just need some more electronics, some more copper, and some more steel. I think it would be pretty cool just to kind of have a, a cooler looking one. So while the glass is doing that, let's grab some gold. We don't need that much gold. And we'll grab some copper. And we'll grab... Actually, we'll go three. And we'll grab... This one of them should be fine. No, I think we need. Well, yeah, because we don't have. Whoops, that much epoxy. And let's craft. See if we max that out. That goes to twenty, so that'll be forty of our epoxy. I think that should be fine. We do need to get some more epoxy, though. Um, I guess I used all of the metals I had on me. Still gonna need some. I've got some oxide on me. Yeah, see, we're we're down we're down oxide pretty good now. Now when I go around, although we do have a lot of this, we could make with the tree sap we could make even more epoxy. Actually, I might do that since I mean why not, right? We have auto miners and we've got the um what's a majinger for it now? So shoot, we might as well just like make all the epoxy we can. That only makes fifty. Is that because of the no? Is that because of the amount of tree sap I had? It is. Okay, this goes through a lot of tree sap. But luckily, we have a ton. We'll keep a little bit for... for cement. There we go. 69. Outstanding. Alright, we don't need the nails anymore. We got the slopey doos for the roof. We should have enough now. Yeah. Flint. Excellent. All right. We are good with glass. Let's get the last... What I say we need? We need three, four, five... Oh, no. I think we only need seven. And then a door. I'm over here waiting for something I don't think I need. I think this is enough. All right. Let's go see what it looks like. We just had a storm, so we should be good. Shouldn't need to worry about... 
um, another storm for a little while. And then we need some railings. Yeah, the thumper's pretty cool, man. Oh, that's right. I needed a big one for that, but oh well. Uh, let's see. Are these the in... Oh, did I grab the interior wood? I didn't. We'll have to go back for that. Um... Oh, wait, no. That's weird. Yeah, we need these facing in. Oh, no, I do need nine. I do need... What? One, one, two, three. Oh, it's four wide. Oops. Okay. Well, if we have a storm, I'll come over and tear those down. So we need three more of those, and we're going to need... We're going to need three more slopes. I miscounted. Yeah, we're going to need three more slopes. And we're going to need... Do I still have the stuff? Down to 41 epoxy. Is that? I wonder if that's going to be enough. Oh, and I stopped the... Stop the glass. Mm. Have some glass left. I have enough glass for one. Okay. And how much epoxy do these take? Okay, we can get the other two with that with no problem. Um, and then we're gonna need two more and three more interior wood. Yeah, yeah, three more interior wood. I miscounted. Thought I, I was all excited, thought I had it done, thought we were good. That's all right. Interior wood is not super hard. Oh, this has got that, um, the buff, the, the wind resistance buff, because I did end up putting plus 25% wind resistance on for future, for future endeavors, you know, because you always start out with wood. All right, that was the last of it. We got the glass, we've got the cement, uh, we've got the tiles. Concrete floor. Oh, you know what? We're going to need... Okay, so it's going to be 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We are going to need 12 of the, of the cement, not 9. There's one, so we need two more. There's those. I need rebar. Always with the rebar, man. Always with the rebar. Ooh. I guess it's a good thing we're doing some more deal already. You go through a lot of steel with uh, with cement. Keep that in mind. We got 35 of these. I thought I just made 40. No, oh, maybe I'm insane. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. All right, let's drop that in there. Let's get two more of these. Oh, baby. Here we go. All right, and these are for the external... The external... Um, Wavy doos. You know, wavy doos. The wavy doos. Right. Now, we're gonna do that. And that. And that. Alright. Now, we need the half. Wait. Oh. I'm such a big idiot. I totally did the wrong floor pieces. Alright, let's put the roof on. So I want to do... Hmm, is it not going to let me? Uh, I want to have it the other way. Let's see if it'll let me do it if I'm out here. I did the wrong pieces. I need the half piece, not the full. Which means I'm going to have to make a crap load more rebar to get that done. It's not going to let me. Maybe I have to reverse these. There we go. Okay. But if we have one, it should let us do all of them now. Is that gonna... Ooh. Hmm. I wonder if that'll protect it. I don't know. I don't know if it will. Maybe we go flat at the top, like that.
Maybe we go flat. Here we go. Okay. I can handle that. I like the way that looks. That's pretty cool. I do wish we could have the glass roof up there without needing to worry about repairing it constantly, but that's not life. That's not reality. All right, let's grab these. Hopefully without falling to our death. Ooh, we can put that on. And then let's go here. And then... Ah, uh, hmm. Let's just put the floor pieces in. Just get it done. Alright, we want them to go out. There we go. And if we end up running power or something out here, we can run it under the floor. That's why I put the cement like this. Come on, baby. Oops. Yeah, there we go. I like it. I like it. Cool. There we are. Okay, so now we're going to need those 12 friggin' pieces, and then we're going to need to pull that top one down. And we've actually got walls. We're just going to need... Because we're going to need a wall... What, three walls on each side? So six. And then one, two, four slopes. Or not slopes, four triangles. Six walls and four triangles. Let's see what we have at the base. We might have it already. Let's see. Nope, not in there. Let's see. So we got some walls. I guess I, yeah, I didn't need these as much as I thought I did. Oh, and I had one. Um... Oh, no, we have the stone triangles. All right, let's grab... Let's grab the tree sap, and we'll grab some more rebar. And can I get four of those triangle pieces? Find out. All right. Oh, and we got the door to put back on. Mm, we are going to need... Oh, and we need the half pieces. We need these. We need 12 of these. Max? Was it 12? Yeah, I think so. Okay, we're gonna need those. We don't need this in our inventory right now. Let's grab a bite. Because these are about to all go bad. We've got so much meat. Like, it's, it's ridiculous how much meat we have. I can make biofuel forever with the amount of meat that I have. That's part of the reason I want to go ahead and put together the biofuel um, oxide dissolver. Not that we're ever going to run up of oxide now, but having the biofuel oxide dissolver will mean we're actually using biofuel for something, you know, even if it's not much. And we do have two of the auto miners doing, doing biofuel, so I guess there's that. What the hell? Something, something's going haywire with my game. Oh, this isn't good. There we go. All right. That was weird. That was weird. I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, we'll go out. Go out. We'll go out. All right, that'll get that. Nope. Uh-oh. There we go. And that, and then... The, oh, we're going to need some lights up here, too, at some point. There we go. Excellent. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. That is, that is, I mean, it's not the best. I would have preferred to have the whole thing made of glass, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, let's put up these. Okay. Oh yeah, see this one? So this is what happens when the when the wall is backwards. Well, the wall is the way it's supposed to be. I wonder, will it sit out like that? Yeah, it'll just float. 
All right, so yeah, what we got to do is we got to drop that. Okay, that glass wall did come into my inventory. And we're going to have to wait for it to... Nope, there we go. And we got to rotate it. And then as soon as we do that, it lets us put it in the way we want it to. All right, I've only got three more ceiling pieces, so I'm going to have to do this from the other side. We have to do it from, let's do it from here. And we'll put a ceiling piece out. Think of it as scaffolding. Whoops. Let's try this again. There we are. All right, and our walls should be protected. Now, in theory, I could rotate these all so they're facing out again instead of being facing in like they are now. But the glass doesn't seem to have much of a different look. So I'm not too concerned with it. All right. So now I just need light. And, you know, I might, you know what I might do? I might put up a couple of grow plots to make flowers on the wall. I think that might be kind of cool. But I think before I do that, I need to make rails and stuff so that I don't fall to my death. Because falling to your death is not good. Oh, yeah, and I also threw the dropship recall beacon, if that wasn't in the video. I think it was, but if it wasn't, yeah, you'll be able to see it as a member video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Uh, it was a little convoluted, but hey, that's life sometimes. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, do me a favor. I got to pull that down. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel for a little bit more content. Leave a comment in the comment section. And, uh... Share the video with your buddies, because YouTube is sharing is caring. YouTube says sharing is caring. And as always, everyone, have a great rest of your day.